everyone loves the old Footloose. What is going to be fresh and cool about the new version? Well, it takes place in current day. The music is current. Everything is uh, spiced up a little bit from the original one. I don't know if you know Craig Brewer's work. He directed the film. He did Hustle and Flow and Black Snake Moan. So you picture those two worlds combining. That's what we did. We made a pretty badass version of Footloose. Now, did any of the original cast come back and kind of give you guys tips, pointers, you know, look over, make sure you guys weren't messing up the, you no. know, the legend? No, they didn't. We knew what the legend was. We, we were all, everyone on set was a big fan of the original, top to bottom. So. We just uh, made sure we didn't mess up. Such, <laughs> a, was, such an established story, established uh, movie, something that people look back to. Uh, it's probably got to be a really delicate dance to make it your own, but still kind of pay homage to what's already been established. Yeah, well, luckily I had a, a great director doing that, you know, staring the shit for me, so I didn't have the pressures of that too much. But I was a big fan of the original, and of course you want to pay homage to the original, but like I said, Craig Brewer sprinkled his uh, Brewer-isms all over the film, so we got to do our own as well. You got casted as a lead. Do you feel like there's a lot of pressure on your back knowing that this film is, you know, a lot of your performance is basically going to carry this film? Yeah, for sure you have pressure, but like I said, having a good director takes a lot of that pressure off. He puts it on himself and lets us just perform. So. And do we predict the theater crowd standing up and dancing and singing the entire time <laughs> during the movie? Well, I think you're going to do that for okay. sure. Oh, thank you. That's yeah. right. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I hope so. <laughs> Thanks, man. Twilight or Harry Potter? Potter. All right. Thanks. <laughs>